What's up you guys? Welcome back to the channel. I always say this, but it's been a hot minute since I've showed any of my Evo content lately. And it's just because Devin has been spending the last week tuning the sing on pump gas. And finally today, we're at the E85 station here in Spokane. We're getting uh, E85 and we're gonna put the sing on Bader's dyno today and see what kind of number she puts down since we just got done building this thing again not too long ago. And we're like super curious to see what this thing makes with this turbo setup. And the previous owner said around 800, which is insane. And I think it's gonna make over, I think it's gonna be right around 700. That's just kind of like the numbers I'm thinking. Meet you guys at the dyno. We got Devin strapping her down. Ah. Oh yeah. He hurt his knee. Must so. get old. It's gonna take a while to dial this thing in. The last couple pulls is gonna be where we really see some power. get done tuning my Evo a lot of you guys have been asking me on Instagram because it's been a few days later what were the numbers that the Evo put down and you guys we actually ran into a few issues and when Devin comes back in here I'll have him explain because it's kind of complex I feel like but we did have to order a few new parts so we're gonna have to do another dyno day soon we just kind of left the car at 575 which is nothing like that turbo is so capable of so much more so we're gonna have to pick that up another day but it's a few days later like I said and we are actually headed over to Seattle Devin's getting a car I'm sure you guys could guess what he's getting I, I think he might just use it as a parts car and it's a good deal, so we're just heading over there. It's nothing too secretive. This old man's really watching Devin. Right there, he's really watching. I just decided to pick up the camera and take you guys with me because I don't really vlog road trips anymore, especially I'm because- I'm gonna go take a leak. Especially because we hit Evos all the time and it kind of gets boring, I feel like, especially in my channel because they're not my cars, but I might as well just take you guys with me. I'm not dieting right now, but I'm still maintaining my weight. I did bring the essentials. We got rice cakes in here, my gallon. Mostly just rice cakes. I had protein bars, but I already ate them. We're just fueling up on some diesel here in Ritzville, Washington, and then we're gonna head over to Seattle. So, yeah, let's get this road trip started. I don't advocate for that. Like, I'm just telling you how it was. History, you understand the pedal and swings back and forth. And when it swings, five hours later. I haven't showed you guys the car that Devin got yet because we don't have a trailer to get the car. Pretty much he got ghosted by the guy who's trying to get a trailer from. And so we don't have the car yet or I would have showed you guys the car. So we're doing a little pit stop here <laughs> in Everett, Washington at Applebee's. I got my wings. I always get my wings. I have a Moscow mule. I always get a Moscow mule and then I have chips. We ended up getting a hotel in Renton. Devin sold a cage out of one of his Evos and I actually ended up getting a stock wing for my Evo along with um, a carbon fiber gurney flap which is like what, what kind of goes off like the top of the, the wing. So stock wing with this carbon fiber piece. A lot of people ask about that carbon fiber piece on my STI, so it's called a gurney flap, and I I feel like they look so good on cars with big wings, or like wings in general. So I'm kind of happy. I've been looking for a stock wing for forever for my Evo, so I'm getting kind of tired 
not gonna lie, it's like 11 o'clock at night and um, yeah, Dev is just helping these guys put this cage in their Evo. I know we just got done eating at Applebee's, but I'm still hungry. I'm craving um, Froyo so bad. First look into our hotel. Devin's already crashing. Cute little kitchen. Devin, we have ice cream to eat. Little bed. Hey, this is actually a really nice place. I have to show you guys what we stopped at the grocery store for. I told you I was still hungry. I got some Halo Top peanut butter. Devin got this big ass thing of chocolate. We're gonna eat a little bit of this and then we're probably gonna go to bed because we're both wiped out. Especially Devin. Fuck trio guy. He can suck my big fat Johnsons. Morning you guys. We are actually at U-Haul this morning. I really wanted a coffee first because I am dying. I'm so tired. I did not get any sleep last night. I don't know if I even explained that very well last night, but we were planning on buying a trailer down here in Seattle. The guy completely ghosted Devin, so we were planning on getting the trailer and then getting the car. So we didn't get the trailer and we still haven't picked up the car yet. So we're here at U-Haul and we're just gonna get a trailer here, which kind of sucks because Devin's really needed a car trailer for like a really, really long time. But anyways, I hope we're gonna get coffee afterwards because I'm dying this morning, but I'll keep you guys posted. This trip hasn't been like overly excited, but I hope you guys are enjoying it. But I'll see you guys if we get some coffee. Found a coffee at a really, really cute little coffee stand. Guys, I was f freaking out this morning because Coda had a freaking haircut because I get him shaved like every other month. So Jared had to take him. So shout out to Jared for taking Coda to his grooming appointment. The hell is this thing? But I really hope they have Lotus here because that's all I get at coffee stands nowadays. Is that a dog? That's fake, honey. That has to be fake. Okay. Okay. Do you guys do Lotus energy? Yeah, we yes. have Lotus. We have pink, purple, blue, and red, and skinny. Okay, I will just do a 20 ounce pink Lotus. Yeah. And can I just do like the tiniest little dot of heavy cream in it? Yeah. And no you, flavor. Okay, no flavor. Yep. Hmm, we have bagels here. Get a bagel. No, too many carbs. I'll do a 24 iced Americano. Yeah, any cream? Um, a little bit of cream with white chocolate powder, please. Yeah. Anything to eat today for you guys? No, thank you. Okay, perfect. It'll be 11 even. Perfect. Thanks, honey. Uh, don't go. Don't mind my hair, you guys. I feel like I need to take a shower. Yes, you do. This is makeup from yesterday, too, but I got the Lotus. If you guys ever try a pink Lotus, don't get any flavor because they're already kind of sweet. But the key is just to get a splash of heavy, Ooh. like just a little drip of heavy cream. Yeah. And they did a little too much in here, I'm not gonna lie. It's a little milky. The key is to get coffee because Lotus is kind of trash. You know, you literally have a Lotus like every day. Bobby, once a month is not every day. Okay, we just made it to the car's location and I'm gonna show you guys what the car looks like. Sheesh. I haven't been to Issaquah. They have the best triple X burgers here, and I've been here one other time with Evan before. Show them. And they literally have ginormous burgers, huge root beer floats. I don't know if we're gonna get one of those, but we're here. We're gonna eat some good food before we travel back. You're gonna eat good food. I'm gonna watch you. I think the main thing I love about this place is it's all like car themed and it's like 40s and 50s themed which I'm obsessed with that era so I really like this place but you guys just look at the menu we got the 49 Woody the 58 Impala like everything's named after old ass cars it's kind of cool Wait, this one isn't, it's not as big as it was last time. Did you get the triple X? Okay, so I didn't get the triple X burger, so this one's not as big, but this thing is still pretty freaking massive. If you know what I mean. <laughs> oh, and by the way, this is my food. 
And this is Devin's food. <laughs> Okay, second stop along the way home. My hair is crazy again, but we found this cute little coffee stand called Gravity in Cleelum. And to be completely honest, I didn't really eat all my burger from that other place because it was like way too fatty for me. It's really empty, so. Okay, I got chocolate banana okay. with peanut butter protein. Tastes like something I, I make at home. No. <laughs> we made it back home after that long ass trip. I am super excited for the Evo Devon got because it's a final edition. Coda's new haircut. See? Coda got a haircut. Coda. <laughs> Looks like a little lion. Devon's Evo is a final edition, so it's super cool on the inside. I don't know what he's gonna do with the car. Whoever knows. He has so many Evos. Update on my car. I never asked Devin exactly what the parts were that we needed to order for my Evo, but I do know they're already here. So when we got back home, they were waiting for us. We will get started on tuning my car again on E85 and hopefully make that seven to 800 horsepower. And I'll keep you guys updated on that. Thank you so much for following along. Remember hit the like button, subscribe button, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Bye.